Hey, what's going on guys? Sinister Skater here, bringing you another episode of Let's Play Minecraft. And today, I'm actually really, really, really excited to show you guys what I have to build, which is the TNT Human Launching Cannon. I've been wanting to do this since like the fifth episode of Let's Play Minecraft, but it didn't work in my, uh, Xbox Minecraft because like it worked before and then they updated it and it didn't work. And I guess this last update, the uh, title update 9 or maybe title update 10, I'm not sure which one. But one of these last two updates... Uh, apparently just re-figured it out and the TNT launcher now works, so now I can show you guys it. And you guys are, I'm guaranteeing you guys will like this and you'll have fun with this thing in your own world. So this is what you're going to need to build this, uh, this mechanism. I have three different ones to show you. One is like a little one that won't hurt you that much. The second one is one that goes a little bit higher. And the third one is one that launches you all the way up to the top of the world where you can't go up anymore. So, as I said, what you'll need is something to build with. I'm building with these uh, stone, cobblestone blocks, whatever they're called. Uh, TNT, a button, or lever you can use, whatever, but I prefer a button. It looks, uh, it just works better. You're going to need redstone, some redstone repeaters for the biggest one. And water bucket, and maybe an empty bucket in case you need to pick up your water because you misplaced it or anything else. So, to get started with this first one, you're going to want to build a 5x5 five five hollow block. So move this over as far as possible so we have room for the other one so it'll be like one two three four five and one two three four five one two three four five whoops five and then fill this other in so just like this and then around the whole ring of it you're going to put going to want to put redstone going around the whole thing and then right in the middle of one side of the block you're going to want you're going to want to put a block going three high just like this with a button on top and then if you press the button, it activates all the redstone. <laughs> redstone. Oh, a little voice crack right there. So then right in the middle of this 5x5 five five block, you're going to want to put a bucket of water. And then, actually, um, don't do the bucket of water first. It'll be more hectic. You're going to want... I can't say going to want to. Um, put two blocks up like this, then delete the bottom block, and then put the bucket of water under that, just like that. And then the last thing you need to do is load it up with TNT. So put TNT all around the water. Don't put it on the source block because you'll delete the source and then blow up whatever you're building it next to. So just like that. And then you hop up on top of this and you press the button. TNT ignites and you will be launched into the air just like this. Nice little one. It won't damage you. You might want to have some diamond armor just so. I mean it will damage you but you won't kill you. You might want to have diamond armor on just so you don't get as much damage. Which I'm actually going to put a diamond chest piece on because I don't know why but I feel like doing it. So you're going to want to do that, and um, that's that. So now, that's the smallest one. On to the next biggest one. Same building idea, you're just going to want to do 7x7 seven seven now. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Same thing. Then right in the middle, you're going to want to put a block. Block on top, delete it. Put a bucket of water under it. And then again, line the whole ring with some redstone. Just like we did on the other one. And then put in the middle again. Put two up. Button on top. And then load the outside edges with TNT. Don't load the inside ring with TNT. Just the outside. So you're doing about uh, the 5 by Kind of like the 5x5 five five layer TNT. Just like that. Hop on top of the block. Oops. Hop on top of the block. Okay. Hop on top of the block like that. Press the button. TNT will ignite, and this will launch you about halfway up into the world, just like this. Right about into the cloud level. Come back down. This one will definitely kill you. Going to want to put it next to a nice open water source like this big lake, so you don't injure yourself, so you can come down or build like a ring of, a ring of water around this, something like that. Just like that. And for this last one, um, what, oh, what's this? This is a nice little, what is this? Oh, it's a semi, wait, just keep going. No, it stops. Semi-ravine, huh? Um, that's kind of cool how the vines are going down. But for this last one, built it over here. As you can tell, it looks more complex, better to do. I'm going to show you the outline basis to do it right over here. And this one will launch you all the way to the top of the world, which is pretty sick. So first things first, you're going to want to build a 5x5 layer like the first one we built in the ground this time. Let me uh, put a nice little block right here. Into the ground. So... You could just do it with grass, really, but I'm just going to hollow it out and replace it with the stone so you can see, and it looks cooler. And hollow out the center, and then put a bucket of water right in the middle, 
and you don't have to put a blocker TNT in there yet. So then you're going to want to put, or then you're going to want to put redstone going all the way around like we did before. And then load the layers on the outside corners with TNT. Just like this. Now, what this does, or what you're going, uh, I don't know how to explain this. What you're going to want to do is put a block leading out like this and then put uh, space away a but, uh, a block with a button on it so when you activate it, it oh crap whoops got this TNT in there activates that um and then let me reload this real quick whoops I just deleted the water source block what's going on okay then what you're going to want to do is build another ring on top of it just like this one space above so again another five by five hollow layer of block just like this and then put TNT along the outside edges like this like you did below and then you're going to want to again put redstone going all the way around like this and then you're going to want to put this uh from like this right here like it's perpendicular put a block going out and then you want to build up to where this uh will connect just like this and then you go ahead and do that for as many times as you want. I did it five times, I think, over here. As you can see. Then I had to put a repeater so the source wouldn't run out. You run it all the way up to the top. And then if you press the button, it will ignite the TNT. So let's load this up with TNT real quick. Okay, whoopsies. Oh, I see what happened. This uh redstone repeater kept the system locked and kept it open. So I had to fix that. But then you're going to want to go ahead and put TNT. Alright, sorry about that. People just decided to start yelling in my house and you could pick it up on the microphone. So I just started to stop and um, load the TNT right now so you didn't have to bore or be bored watching me load that with TNT. And I just slept so it's daytime so you could see better. And um, yeah, so like I said, you just go up to the top, jump right down in here and we press the button. All the TNT falls down on top of you and then... You get launched all the way up to the top of the, uh, like, above the top of the world. And, um, yeah, you, you just need to find some place that you will launch into a nice big lake of water like this. Which I tried to aim for, but it didn't really work out. I got pushed up by all the TNT down there. But hopefully you guys enjoyed that. I know it's really, really awesome. I've been wanting to do that for a while. Again, you got this really one that launches you above the top layer, which is... The top layer of the world is uh, basically at this cloud level right here as we built this uh, thing that we're building um, right here. So I guess this one launches you above the top level of the world. This one right here, the 5x5, launches you basically to the top of the world, the cloud level. And then this one launches you about, I'd say, like this high up into the... Um, up into the sky and it's pretty awesome so hopefully you guys enjoyed that hopefully you'll build it all in your worlds and we'll have fun with it and as always i'm Sinter skater and i'll see you guys on the next video peace out